Now here at home, NASA is preparing for tomorrow's touchdown of the space shuttle Discovery. Meanwhile, fourth graders in Highlands Ranch are learning to solve a space emergency. 7 News anchor Mike Landis is in the newsroom with more on this story. Mike? And their challenge is to retrieve a lost spacecraft in a real-life space simulation. These are students at Denver Christian School Highlands Ranch campus. They connected with a NASA flight director to complete their mission. And 7 News photojournalist Eric Goody takes us there. Over. They have a mission to find a distant lost ship. Your teams are going to help us find and rescue this lost ship today. They have to work together as a team just like you would in a normal working environment. So we're all doing pretty well. Yes. All right? All right, let's keep it up, all right? I hope this works. They have lost all their navigation system. I would say a good 20 hours of training went into this, and we are training them to become working professionals in a world. Mission Control, we have... Uh, news from Neptune that they have, uh, they think they is six days for the trip. I do not concur with that answer. Can you have them go recheck that data, please? Four, four. If they're not working as a team, well, they're not going to succeed. Neptune says six days for the trip. Is that correct? Over? Yes, over. That is correct. Jupiter did an excellent job with that. That is correct. It's wonderful to be able to use your tech, you know, um, in this way. If we can see mission control um, live and they can see us live. So that has been huge. Your team has done an outstanding job. You've located the lost ship. Well done, Pluto. So news photojournalist Eric Goody. Those are fourth graders. The next mission for these kids to design, build, and even launch a rocket. Teachers at Denver Christian School Highlands Ranch say the math and science skills, along with problem-solving ability, were essential to the students' successful mission today.